Welcome to STC News. My name is Lexi. Today we are going to be talking about the weather. Not only that, but we have a cool Bob Ross commercial coming up. Today's big main event will be on positivity and motivation. Hope you guys enjoy. Bienvenidos a STC News. Mi nombre es Kimberly. Hoy vamos a hablar sobre el clima. No solamente eso, tenemos un comercial genial sobre Bob Ross viniendo pronto. Nuestro tema principal es sobre positividad y motivación. Espero que disfrutes el video. Hola estudiantes de Remer, soy Eliazar y hoy nosotros vamos a estar anunciando el clima de hoy de la semana. En la mañana va a estar un poco frío, como a los grados 50 y 60, pero en la tarde va a estar mayormente cálido, como a los grados 70 por 90. Y ahora un anuncio muy, muy serio. Uh, hello Remer students, it's me Valerie and today I'll be announcing this week's sweater. In the morning, it will be around 50 and 60 degrees, uh, but in the afternoon it will be mostly. It's going to be mostly sunny, like around 70 to 90 degrees. And now for a very very serious advisement. Welcome to the Bob Ross Ross Bob Show. Well, today we're going to be showing you art. Today we're, I'm going to teach you how to make a very realistic lip because I am Ross Bob. Okay. So first you're going to do a line. Make sure to get a paper. Next, you're going to do a circle. Amazing. Then you're going to do this, which is the main color of your lip. And then you're going to do a happy face. And then you're going to do a sad face on here. And that's really simple. Oh, it fell. OK. Where is it? I can't see it. Oh, here it is. OK, and that's how you do a realistic lip. Now, um, Bob Ross is going to show you how to do a really cool fountain. Wait, how did you do that? I could never do that. Uh, I'm not a good drawer. Anyways, and now I'm going to be showing you how to draw a fountain. Because I am Bob Ross. So first, you got to do a square, obviously. And then you got to do some water. And then another square. And then a happy face. And then, we did a code. And this is how you draw a fountain. <laughs> Where do you think that is? What? And no, this was the Rob Ross Draws Off Show. That was amazing. Hello, we're Mark Two. We're going to talk about positivity and building a mindset. Being positive helps you lead to a better mindset, and it's good for your mental health. And when you have a good mental mindset you can be able to follow three R's such as respectful responsible and building relationships when you're positive you could you could be able to um, reach your life goals so that's why it's good being positive and having a healthy mindset la positividad también puede ayudar a, a, a construir un, la mentalidad sana y esa mentalidad sana puede ayudarte con tu mentalidad y también la negatividad puede causar la ansiedad y eso puede um, causar dolor de cabeza. Así que no seas como la persona negativa y imaginaria y, se, y tú seas diferente. Tú piensas positivo. One thing before we start about the events. Make sure to drink lots and lots of water. Like a lot. For this week, um, events is um, the trimester awards um, assembly. The fruit of the week, which is um, pineapple chunks, not chunk, we're not eating the president. And last but not least, the spring break, which is one week from now. Antes de anunciar los anuncios de hoy, te he preparado para tomar agua esta semana. Los eventos de esta semana van a ser el trimestre de la asamblea del trimestre. También la fruta de hoy y esta semana va a ser piña. No niña, piña. Entonces, esta semana también va a ser la última semana antes de la, las vacaciones de primavera. So, one more reminder. Um, make sure to keep our restrooms clean. Otro recordatorio. Trata de dejar limpios los baños cuando los uses. Bye. <risa> Welcome to SET News. My name is Lexi. Today we are going to be talking about
Oh, <laughs> 